America sees another new marvel of aviation, the Sikorsky helicopter. The takeoff, 90 degrees straight up. This experimental model, a veteran of hundreds of test flights, goes aloft to attempt to break the world's endurance record for flight over one spot. Vertical flight. Since 400 BC, man has tried to build helicopters. This American invention came out in the 1920s, did not rise. This windmill plane was another product of a decade ago. Freaks, people called them, laughed at them, and air-minded dreamers went ahead building, scheming, and failing. But each time, aviation learned something new, something important. These flapping flops of yesterday each played a part in today's great triumphs of aviation, though more than faith took a shaking. Hovering in a May 1941 sky, Igor Sikorsky and his helicopter proved that vertical flight has arrived. U.S. military observers see important uses for this craft that, supported only by its main rotors down draft, notice the blown grass, utilizes three-tailed propellers for control of flight forward, sideways, backwards, or in circles. Sikorsky has at last achieved in a machine the hummingbird's flight the poised suspension in the air of the little bird that started Leonardo da Vinci drawing helicopter plans 500 years ago. One hour and 32 and a half minutes of flight in suspension, a new world's record. Able to land within 18 inches of any given spot, the helicopter may open a vast new field of air tactics to American airmen who won't believe the phrase, there ain't no such bird.